So what happened to the Duolingo logo? So as you can see right now, the logo kind of looks tired or looks old, how you name it. So it's basically April Fool's joke. That's what Duolingo app does. They often change their icons either for Halloween or April Fool's or some other dates. Uh, so that's just what it is. It's not connected to your progress or that you're being deleted or something like that. Uh, no, this is just kind of a joke from Duolingo. It's very weird. This app often does it. I don't know many apps uh, who does that. It's kind of like a weird marketing trick. Some people like it. Some people are super confused. Some people hate it. So that's just what you have. Um, so what you can do, you can just wait and like in a few weeks it will go back to normal, maybe even faster, maybe in one week. Um, just make sure to up, to enable auto update for Duolingo or update to the latest version. Also, what you can do, you can just uh, try to, uh, you know, replace the icon. It's more complicated, really, if you just can't wait like 10 days. Uh, so, yeah, you can use like shortcuts, app. Um, and you know just uh, you know get a normal uh, image of Duolingo app icon and create uh, an you know an action to open app um, um, so and then just you know this this is just another tutorial but it's completely possible to do that also you can use some other apps like theme kit whatever theme pack where you can just uh, create a customizable Duolingo uh, app icon and just use that and this original app you can just tap to remove it and move it to remove from home screen and move it to app library and only use the normal standard Duolingo app icon.